Hello dear traders, you're watching Financial News on Insta TV with me, Anna Kasatkina. And your trading day kicked off with a series of macroeconomic data from China. Traders absorbed a report on industrial production, the key sector of China's economy. According to the government data, China's factory output expanded by 7.2% in January and February from a year earlier. The fresh reading is well above a 6.3% rise projected in the median forecast. Besides, retail sales jumped 9.7% in annual terms. However, investors should not neglect the decision of Washington on steel and aluminium tariffs. Experts warn these measures will slash supplies from China. The worth of exported goods from China China totals 30 billion US dollars per year. This morning, Washington media reported that Secretary of State Rex Tillerson is out of the White House. He has been replaced by CIA Director Mike Pompeo, who is determined to struggle against the Chinese threat. This does not seem a pure coincidence. Meanwhile, investors are baffled by this reshuffle. Resignation of Rex Tillerson sprang a surprise to the markets. Donald Trump dropped a hint that he will fire anyone who does not take account of the president's viewpoint. The US dollar index is still reading under pressure at around 89.70. The US dollar lost its modest gains versus the yen in the Asian trade. The dollar-yen pair again sank below 107 points. Market participants are braced for a turbulent trading day. The U.S. is due to present retail sales data, which is a report of crucial importance, as consumer spending is responsible for nearly two-thirds of the U.S. GDP. Follow the latest developments on financial markets with us on Insta TV. See you back soon.